Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to share with you two awesome high growth spray that can help you minimize excess shedding, also stop breakage while stimulating a new high growth. So if you're interested, please be sure to keep on watching and watch till the end of the video so you get to see both sprays and also instructions on how you can use it. Now before we get into the video, I want to say a huge thank you if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for always watching my videos always liking and engaging with my content i really do appreciate that and if you're new here guys please consider clicking the subscribe button to join the family i make lots of diy recipes for healthy high growth and maintenance so if you're into this type of content please join us by just clicking the subscribe button now let's hop into the video so to begin with we are going to need some green tea now green tea helps to promote healthy high growth, it helps to nourish the scalp to promote healthy high growth and also it helps to create new cell rejuvenation to inhibit hair fall and boost new high growth. So I used two tea bags. Next, we're going in here with some bay leaves. Now, bay leaves also are quite beneficial for high growth because it helps to eliminate downdraft from the scalp, which can inhibit just your natural high growth cycle. And essentially, it also helps to remove free radicals and you know all the effects that that can have on your hair. So I added a few leaves and then I went in with some rosemary. So rosemary again you guys know is very very beneficial when it comes to increasing the blood circulation to the scalp which in turn brings more nutrients to your follicles and can help with promoting healthy high growth. So I added that and then I went in with some water and I'm just boiling the whole thing. So you want to boil it for just a few minutes until you notice that the water is becoming quite dark in color just like you can see here so turn off your stove allow it to cool down and then we're going to go ahead and strain it it is pretty much that simple guys pretty simple and easy to make yet very very effective Now once that's all strained, pop it in an applicator bottle or a spray bottle and then you're ready to use. Now some of you guys often ask how long you can keep this. You can keep it in your fridge for up to 2 weeks or even 3 weeks depending on the temperature of your fridge. Or you can make batches of this guys and freeze and defrost and use as and when is required. I do that quite often as well because it saves me time. Um, but yeah, you can keep it in the fridge and use it for that length of time that I just mentioned. So this is it here. It's quite nice and ready. I'm going to go ahead and apply it to my hair. So I'm going to tell you guys how you can use this. It's very, very simple. You just put it to your scalp because that's where your hair grows up from. And essentially our scalp is very, very important when it comes to just having healthy, growing hair in general. If you have an unhealthy scalp, it is very likely your hair is going to fall out and perhaps your hair is not even going to grow because yeah the environment is just not suitable for that so make sure you spray it throughout your the entirety of your scalp and also spray it throughout the rest of your hair so the ends uh, your edges and basically all of that good stuff make sure that your hair is properly saturated with this once you've sprayed it on your hair guys you can leave it in if you want to which means you can just follow with an oil or a butter just to help you to seal the moisture in. Or you can go ahead and wash this out of your hair using shampoo if you want to or just rinse it out with just warm water. In this case, because it was my wash day, my hair actually needed washing anyways. So I went ahead and shampooed my hair after, after using it. So essentially, after I finished applying it to the hair, just like you saw here, I put a plastic bag on just to allow heat to penetrate the hair and you know the moisture to really get in there and then I went ahead and shampooed my hair just because it was my wash day but just like I said you can leave it in or you can um, just rinse it off with just warm water next we're going to move on to the next spray um, which again I'm pretty sure you guys would definitely love 
Okay guys, so let's move on to the next one. So the next one is this pray right here and it contains only three main ingredients that are super easy to find. So to begin with, you are going to need a jar. Next, we'll be going in with some uh, fenugreek seeds. Now fenugreek seeds are super, super beneficial for high growth because it helps to stimulate new high growth. It's a rich source of iron and protein which are essential nutrients when it comes to just healthy hair in general. It con also contains a unique composition of plant compounds like flavonoid and saponins and these are presumed to induce high growth due to the anti-inflammatory and anti-fungal properties. So I use two tablespoons of fenugreek seeds. Next I'm going in here with some fennel seeds you can get this in your regular uh, asian store if you've got any available in your area or even amazon has this as well fennel seeds are high in vitamin c magnesium calcium phosphorus iron which essentially helps to prevent hair loss it also helps to strengthen the hair follicles by bringing nutrition to the scalp Next, we're going in here with some rosemary. Just like we saw earlier, rosemary helps to increase the blood flow to the scalp, which in turn brings more nutrients and oxygen to your follicles, which can help in stopping hair loss and also promoting new hair growth. So I added those to the same jar. Now I went in with some hot water. I'm gonna close this and allow it to infuse for at least 12 hours. Or if you want, you can infuse it overnight. And then after it has infused guys, we're going to go ahead and strain and it will be ready to use. So after it sat around and infused for at least 12 hours, this is what it looks like. You know it's ready when the fenugreek seeds have more than doubled in size. Also notice that the uh, rosemary have darkened in color. So we're pretty much ready to strain it. So it's very simple. You just need to get a bowl and then pour the mixture on there. And then that's pretty much it. Again, you can transfer it into an applicator bottle or a spray bottle and essentially use the same way that we talked about earlier just like i showed you guys um previously so you're going to spray it onto your hair and essentially leave it in uh, and then follow with like an oil or a butter just to help you keep the moisture in or you can go ahead and rinse it out of your hair and or even shampoo it out of your hair so it really just depends on you guys it's very very easy simple and quick to make yet it's very very effective as well so this brings me to the end of the video i hope that you guys have enjoyed watching and if you did please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and also guys please subscribe to the channel if you're not already i would really appreciate that also leave me a comment if you got a question or anything perhaps that you would like to know i will try my best to get around to answering it and uh, yeah that's pretty much it for today thanks for watching guys until next time bye